What up, everyone? Difficult People Chronicles, Seriously Focused Johnny, SF Johnny. Today's episode is... Well, I can't seem to get it together sometimes. <laughs> Today's episode is called Show Me My Enemies. One of the things I've been doing ever since I was younger is I would pray to God. And I would say, you know, if I, if, if I didn't have warning signs or... I just felt some kind of way about a person and I wasn't too sure. I was I would pray and say, I would say, God, show me my enemies. Then I would pray that my heart is protected. <laughs> because when God shows you his your enemies, he's gonna show you your enemies. And in the end term of things, sometimes we get hurt behind it. But that's one of the things that's been saving me. Because sometimes you could have an enemy that is so close. They can reach you. And what happens, they've been in your life for so long, they can do a lot of damage. And another thing, too, is that when you're working on your blessing, I mean, your destiny, you know, what God has for you, it's important that they don't come along for the ride. And the reason why I say that is because they don't have nothing to offer but drama. They can be spies or monitoring spirits. They can try to tear you down. And take you down to rock bottom and then it's more of a struggle to get back with everything you've lost and sometimes there's hidden lessons being around them that you're not paying attention to and they're not warning signs they're lessons like for example a lesson would be you know this person is always talking a lot about mm, other people just talking just talking just talking and then one day you just catch them in a lie. It's not about you. You think it's harmless. But you got to ask, why is this person always talking so much? And the lesson is, if they're going to talk about other people the way they do, they're going to talk about you. So keep your mouth shut. Your business is off limits. A lot of times we don't pray about the people around us. And we go into different seasons like five, six years around a person that's not supposed to be around us. And we're looking like, why are we not moving forward? And sometimes it's because you're around that person with negative energy. That's why one of the things when uh, people say to me, oh, you can't keep cutting all sorts of people off and this and that. I'm one of those people, I give people so many chances. I give them so many chances in the past. And I realized as I got older, a lot of these people are not coming coming with me. They just not, they not ready. They do more damage than damage control. <laughs> you know, they cause more headaches. And a lot of times they do stuff that could be prevented. So I just had to like, every now and then when I'm around a person and I don't know, my spirit feels some kind of way about them, like they're talking and what they're saying is not adding up. I go behind the scenes in my home, pray and meditate, and I ask God, show me my enemies. Whatever he reveals to me, so be it. That's going to be my next move, you know, meaning that I pray to him and, you know, God, what should I do next? And he tells me and I'm out. I don't concern myself with their feelings because they weren't thinking about my feelings when they were doing stuff behind the scenes. So, and that's a message for you all because that could be one of the main reasons, key ingredient to getting to the next level. The key ingredient is that one thing you have to get rid of to move forward. So that's it for today. Love me more. And I love you more. One-on-one -on -one sessions. Hit me up. SeriouslyFocusedJohnny.com. Check out my store. And hit me up with suggestive topics. And like I told y'all before, I'm on YouTube. Check me out. Like and subscribe. And uh, I'll be doing live soon. Yeah. <laughs> Just bear with me. Later.